Hey guys, this is Maduba John from MJC Designs. Welcome to today's video tutorial. Today, I want to show you guys how to create a complex roof. Now, you want to create a roof with um, a different level that has different levels. Okay, but you want the roof to look like it's it's just one it's 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 just one roof. You need to roof this and roof this and let it look like they are combined. Okay, but they are of different level. All you need to do is we are going to first of all create the the facial with a complex profile before we um, jump onto the roof. So let's create this right now. So you go to your option, complex profile, and we'll look for um, facial, or we we'll just create our facial. Let's create new facial. Facial. Okay. And then we use our fill to, to create something. Give it a height. Uh, let's say 450 by 450. Okay, so we just create some node, create some node, push it in by maybe 50, 50. So So that's pretty much this and then we might want to maybe add some details on here and there but maybe reduce remove this um, but the main thing is the curve out here so just like so okay so this is fine so we just change the color to white okay now that's fine so we just save and play OK. We we'll go back to our wall. And we draw. We we'll go back to our wall. Go to complex profile. Change it to facial. And we draw. OK. First of all, draw the first height. Okay. And draw the second height. Go to the three D. Drag them up. Those things we can always correct them here. Okay. Change to white. Same thing here. Okay. And that's pretty much it okay so what we'll do is we are going to first of all go to the top floor where it is showing good so we are going to roof this 
first that is take this off pick the roof make sure this is selected and this is selected okay or complex roof so we just pick this 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 point follow the point like so like so and then end it right there you can see that the eve are out you can always go to the settings and remove it the offset change it to zero okay you we'll go back to the right foot position so let's check our 3d as you can see this right here we don't want that let's go back to our settings and change it pick select this and change it to one okay we can always go to change our uh, roof okay now that's fine okay so we have successfully roofed to this first one but this is not what we want we will still want it we still want this roof to go like so to make it look like one entity so what we we'll do is we'll go to this pick this roof go to this and draw draw it differently okay we will go to the 3d now and check what it looks like so we would drag to its right foot position as you can see it is different from what we want right oh it has been shifted let's put it back to the proper position from what we want looks like they are separate but we can always make it just connect this to this point here okay so just if you drag this to change to gable end let's end it here and you see it has almost connected okay then I drag it more can see drag it more as you can see it's looking like one roof right now you can always change the angle maybe to 50 okay 50 to increase the height As you can see it's looking like an entity right now as you can see this is how to go about it but you would notice that some of the roof are gradually coming out from here we can always work on it by it's either you use the um, connect method let's pick this and isolate it all right so we can do this this way or just do it manually now you connect okay you say trim to trim element to roof then you pick the first one as you can see it has connected perfect right looking very perfect the problem is that they just show everything you see the problem now here is the problem that is the problem right there because it's taking the shape of this roof 
where it is taking the shape of this part here now giving us space which is not so good so for me instead of using this method to connect it i would just rather undo everything right and just do it manually okay but before i do it manually uh we would redo to see the shape it gave us when when it connected as you can see the shape it gave us when it connected that's the shape we are likely to create okay that's the shape right there this shape that's the shape we are likely to create okay so we just undo okay and undo and go back to maybe using line to to get the outline like so okay and then mirror this mirror a copy and then what we are going to do now we can't edit this like this we can't edit it lines we should split it okay when you select your right click and split into into different panels okay so you can see it will it will be splitted and grouped so you can suspend the group and work on each panel okay so we don't have those uh let me use this so we can easily view it So you can see it's it just straight without giving us any distortion okay same thing we apply here so it's fine like this pretty good like this so this is how to create a complex roof in making it easy you don't have to sweat it thank you so much for watching and i will see you in my next one bye bye